the Boresight Solutions Sexified 365XL loaded up with SuperVel. This has Ben's Razorback. That palm swell really fills up the hand and gives you a lot of good leverage. Let's do a mag dump because it's really awesome in these ammunition rich times to just dump ammunition. Golly, you can really feel the extra control that that little bit of meat does on the back of the, the grip frame. Hey guys, Mickey Shook here with Carry Trainer. Drew behind the camera. We are professional firearms instructors. We travel the country, passing on the knowledge that we have gleaned from some of the best people in the business. One of them happens to be Ben Simonson from Boresight Solutions. Ben is one of the fathers, godfathers, principal guys that started to customize and improve polymer pistols. In fact, their motto is built for the fight. This is a SIG P365 XL, the little li bit larger model. And what Ben did to this was, of course, one of his stipple jobs, but this is their signature razor back. Basically, they add material to the back of the frame, and as it fits into the hand of a grown-up, that little grip swells up a little bit, and it makes the gun easier to hold. Done a lot of videos on the P365 and the XLs. We love them. In my opinion, it's probably one of the best modern concealed carry weapons available. It's a nine millimeter. You can get either the 12 rounders, so 12 plus one of nine millimeter, or the larger 15 round magazines. So you could literally have 15 plus one on board. Easily concealable. This gun is empty. I've got that in a Vetter light tuck and I'm wearing a t-shirt. It disappears and you've got enough ammo to really take care of most problems. I'm not gonna talk about that today as much as the gun itself. A lot of videos that we've done on this, shooting, we have broke a P365 on video and shared that with you. We don't hide stuff. SIG does not give me these guns. We pay for them. I just dig them. Thousands of rounds, thousands of rounds we've fired through these. I've taken them to classes with people like Pat McNamara, where I was a student, with guys like Scott Jedelinski, with guys like Gabe White and others. And I shoot the snot out of them where other students are running big dot guns, trying to shoot fast. I shoot the gun that we carry and I dig it. So today, just a quick rundown on how this behaves differently than the standard grip and why you may want to invest in one. So we've got uh, Jerry Reston down there. It's a paper target. You'll notice it's been shot up. We were doing some footage for another video today. Jared's face is unmolested by bullets right now. So we're just gonna run some rounds, go through a simple basic draw stroke and just see how that gun feels. Dump that mag. What I like about the XL is for me to get the mags out, it's a lot easier than the regular 365 because the grip is longer and I don't have to break my hand open. If you see some of the other videos, for me to change the magazine quickly in these, what I found is to open up the support hand and push the button with my support hand thumb. Some people have commented, why not just flip the magazine release to the uh, right side of the gun. I'm not going to do that for me. I've got too many years of shooting pistols with a left hand mag release. I'm not going to relearn that, uh, nor am I going to make it different for all the guns. I'm just going to keep it on one side. Food for thought. If you only shoot one gun, maybe that's what you want to do. So we've got a uh, 15 rounder now. We'll go back to the holster. Those were all nice face shots. We're at about six, seven yards. We'll do it again. Sorry, Jared. And you can see the gun's very controllable. Immediately what I feel, this little bit of additional material that Ben's team added here allows me a lot more leverage on the gun and it fills my hand up nicer. What I'm not having to do is really crush down on the gun. So support hand or strong hand only, I really, 
feel the difference in the way that it fills my hand up. We got a piece of steel out there at uh, about 30 yards. Let's get a couple hits on it. We got a head swinger out there at 30 yards. If I get careful here, let's see if I can get, get a hit on that. There we go, one and done, all right! That's why I love this gun. That's a five inch piece of uh, steel from TA Targets. We're at at least 30 yards here. We could pace it off. I don't know if you've got a target cam out there. Maybe the, the Yi might be picking it up. Let me see if I can get another hit on that. There we go. You got another mag, Kanan? Yep. Let's try that again. Now I'm doing it, I'm gonna do it. There we go. It's really interesting when you actually utilize the fundamentals of marksmanship, how bullets go where they're supposed to. 115 grain Supervel, just good old fashioned American made ammunition out of a really well made compact pistol. You can get good hits. Uh, you're seeing a five inch target swinging around at 30 yards. There's no red dot on here. You got another one? Oh, you already gave it to me. Ben knows what he's doing. I love this. I've got it on a few guns, but on this little gun, it takes it from a good little gun to a great little gun, depending on your hand size. And by the way, if you look at how hard I hold the pistol, can you see that? That's how hard you hold it. Oh, it's just you know, like a bird, like, it, like you don't want it to get away, but like tight enough that it can't get away. Hold the gun. Parting quick thoughts. This isn't like a in-depth video all about the XL. What we're really talking about is the mods that Master Ben at Boresight Solutions did to this gun. That little bit of material causes you to have much greater leverage on the gun, greater leverage, better controllability. It fills your hand up better where you can press the trigger a little bit easier because you don't have to have your hand kind of wrapped around some tiny little thing. Makes it a little bit bigger, but it does nothing in regards to me being able to conceal it. You know what I'm saying? If you are looking for a gun that you could protect yourself, your family with, something that you carry off duty if you're a law enforcement officer or undercover, that's built for the fight, that's what Ben's motto is, I don't think that you can do any better than a 365 XL with his modifications. Look, some of you are gonna say, screw that, it's a Glock 19 or it's a this or a that. That's your opinion, I'm giving you mine. That's why you're here, my opinion. I'm not here to argue with you, I love Glocks. I love my Berettas, but at the end of the day, this little pistol, I was hitting five inch targets at 30 yards, you saw three or four fast hits. Here's the cool thing, if you have one of these guns, you can send the lower to Ben and they can do this. You also, if you wanna keep your original components as SIG made them, Ben can just sell you the lower and because the serialized parts of this gun, I'll give you that, Kanan. The serialized parts are down in here. So basically, you're gonna get this g g lower just stripped. It takes two seconds, believe me, it just push a pin out, drop this in. It takes two seconds to do it, and then you can keep your original if that's what you want, or you can send him yours. But he has these ready to go, usually. Check the website, done. T order it, it shows up no FFL needed because the serialized parts are the internals that are in your gun. BoresightSolutions.com. Ben did not ask me to do this video. Ben's a great friend. He's been a big supporter of Carry Trainer of the S12 events. Uh, personal buddy. I stay at his house when I go there. He cooks me dinner. Sings sweet nothings to help me fall asleep. If you guys dig this channel, subscribe, like, 
make a comment below. Not just to make a comment, share what you liked, what you didn't like. Don't be dickheads. If you write some annoying or, or incendiary thing trying to start a fight, we'll probably just block and delete it. That's not why we're here. We need your support and I love you guys watching the videos. Drew works very hard editing. Please show some appreciation. Tell Drew how much you appreciate it. Share this stuff with your friends. Don't be dickheads. Tell somebody you love them. Be well.